<laughs> so much that. <laughs> Why don't you come looking over here? Well, thank you for doing that guy, because I came very close to fucking blowing your cover. Well, this is going a little better than a lot of stealth games I play. Uh, mind you, I've got it set to a fucking nerf difficulty. But... Hmm. Mm-hmm. Now what? It's time to tip the odds back in our favor. Oh, that's brilliant. Guns? What are you thinking? Relax, Gandhi. They're tranquilizer guns. Totally non-lethal. Your conscience will remain unscathed. <laughs> oh, well. Good idea. Great. Okay, a little bit of advice. These things have lousy range, so we still have to get in close. You okay with that? How to shoot a gun, genius. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> I don't care if I tranquilize him. That poor bastard's, like, at least paralyzed now. Poor bastard. He didn't deserve that. Get up there. Yeah. Those raptors will get us onto the roof if we can get up there. Good thing one of us thought ahead, eh? Yeah. Oh, yours. Oh, look at the guy who brought the who brought the stupid fucking rope. <laughs> I do not have time for this. Yeah, man, let's do this thing. Good headway. Good headway. All right, there's the tower. Getting close. Huh? Appreciate that update, Captain Obvious. <laughs> Shut your mouth. Guards below us. Guards below us. Guards below us. so much while you're fucking rescuing each other. <laughs> it's not rocket science. It's heisting. You son of a bitch. Keep this up. Monkey bars, monkey bars. There's a guard right below you. <laughs> Nearly there. Yeah, but why are the lights still on? Chloe will take care of it, don't worry. Oh, she know. Yeah, Chloe, come on. Ooh, there we go. That's my girl. <laughs> yeah, I just I had to know. Okay. We're clear.
Ladies first. <laughs> Cute. Here we go. Drake's three. Oh, there it is. Yeah, and there's the acoustic alarm. Until we get this case unlocked, that thing's gonna go off. We so much as touch this glass. No worries, mate. It's fine if you touch the base, though. <laughs> All right. Now we're sure it's the right one. I guess there's only one way to find out. Sorry, Marco. <laughs> Crap. No, there's something on it. I'm sure. Well, that's the understatement of the year. Movies have taught me anything. It. It's bloody useless. The light of the great. Wait a minute. What are you doing? It's resin. It'll burn. And? Just give me your lighter. What? Is that really a good idea in here? And... Ooh. Let me see that. Our ships were driven by a great flood tide into the wilds of Java. Sounds like they were hit by a tsunami. Yeah, somewhere off the west coast of Borneo. Oh, great. That narrows it down a bit. Uh, look, this mountain must have been the closest landmark where they went aground. We find that mountain. We find the ships. Yeah, good work, mate. Uh, wait, wait, there's more. Okay, Joe. As if the ocean itself sought to throw off the terrible cargo we carried from Shambhala. The curse of the Chintamani. Would that mean something to you? Shambhala? Oh, my God, Flynn. What? Marco Polo found Shambhala. Shangri-La. Mm -hmm. Joking. If they were carrying the Chintamani stone, it might still be there. It's all very fascinating, but we've really got to go. Yeah, I'm right behind you. What the hell are you doing? Sorry, mate. This is where we part ways. Ooh, piece of shit. Yeah, wait, Flynn, we had a plan. No. You had a plan. Turns out I've got one of my own. Of course. On, the double the cross. Oh yeah, right. You're the mastermind. Only you overlooked one little detail. Didn't you, partner? So what are you gonna do? Shoot me now? No. I just need you out of the way for a little while. Oh, shit. You think I didn't know about the ships from the beginning? Any schoolboy could have figured that out. Flynn. Listen, face it, genius. You've been played. Ah, uh -uh, not yet. I want to give the guards a decent head start. Right, that's my cue. No hard feelings, yeah? Oh, balls. This won't bode well for me. Seriously? What the fuck do I do? Oh, I see. Ooh. 
<laughs> yeah, I feel like in the first game I never would have survived that. See you, suckers. God bless easy mode. Oh shit. You overlooked one little detail, didn't you? <laughs> Face it, genius, you've been played. Oh, really? <gasps> hey, hey, hey! Jackass, you're ruining the show here. Oh, you son a of a bitch. Sully! I really can't leave you alone for a minute. <laughs> oh, man, I'm glad to see you. How you doing, kid? Uh, I'm doing just great. Oh, Sully. Had to grease a few palms. Did go through the rest of your money. A good chunk of my own, but... Hey. <laughs> Jesus, you stink. Yeah, not half as bad as that cigar. Yeah. Hey, how'd you find me? Well, a uh, friend of yours asked for my help. Hello, Nate. Oh, no. No. Now, wait a Sully, second. Sully, kick her out and shut the door. We're safer in here. Just <laughs> wait a goddamn minute. <laughs> Peer around. Thank you, Victor. Hey, no offense, Sully, but you're not exactly the best judge of character, especially when it comes to women. Fair enough. All the same. Dear God. <laughs> no, it's not that bad. <laughs> Look. I have my own bucket. Mm. Last cell I was in, eight of us had to share. Listen, Nate. You know something I really appreciate you dropping by? But if you and Flynn hadn't screwed me over in the first now, place, I wouldn't minute. have been rotting in this shithole for the last three Nate. months. So excuse me if I'm not just, you know, leaping into your arms. I had nothing to do with it. Right. I told you. He's not going to listen to me. Screw this. Nate, they found the ships. In Borneo. Yes. And the Chintamani stone? How do you know about that? Do you really think Flynn could have figured that out on his own? All right, good point. <laughs> no, they haven't found it yet. You mean they? Flynn and his client, Bazarovich. You know, the nutcase. They've been working together all along. All right, then. If they haven't found the stone, that means there's still time. You're going to get us into that dig site. We are going to snatch that treasure right out from under them. They'll never see it coming. Payback's a bitch. <laughs> Look, they called it the uh, wish fulfilling jewel. It's a sacred object. What, like a Buddhist holy grail? Exactly. Thanks. Sully, listen to this. In the kingdom of Shambhala lies the most precious thing to be found in all the world a perfect raw sapphire of the deepest blue, larger around than the reach of a man's arms. <laughs> That's gotta be worth millions. Hundreds of millions. And you say there's more of this? Loads more. Lazarevich paid top dollar for Marco Polo's journals. He's been after the Chintamani stone for years. <laughs> well, if he's been counting on Flynn to find it for him, it's no wonder he hasn't had any luck. <laughs> if I can get a look at Lazarevich's files, I can find that stone. Uh, hang on a minute. All right, I'm That's fucking suckered in. This game's awesome. The files are in his tent, and his tent is in the middle of the camp. It's like an armed Even if it's heist, but whatever, it's fine. <laughs> well... That's why it has to be an inside job. From someone they know and trust. Oh. Okay, I see where this is going. I just need a diversion. You give me five minutes in that tent, that's all it'll take. Really? Five minutes? Well, that's great. I won't even have to get my top off. Chloe, I was thinking more like an explosion. Or well, that can be arranged. Are you in? Oh, hell yes. I was in before you were. <laughs> Bitch, I've been since breakfast. Alright. Hey, that's it. That's where I'm going to cut it tonight because I do still have more games to go through. Be sure to check out the Is That All podcast for all of your geek news. You can find us anywhere you can stream and download podcasts and find us on social media at Is That All Pod. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps me grow and lets me know that you guys like the content that I'm putting out there. Don't forget to check out more videos, especially more console capers. You can check me out everywhere at BV TV.